What's up everybody, Typical Game here with your daily YouTube live streams and more and today for you I actually have a video, this is the Days Gone walkthrough part number 3 and I'm actually in New York from now until Friday so uh, there's going to be some videos, hopefully I'll be able to live stream while I'm there but uh, if not there will definitely be um, a few videos at least for you to watch so if you watch and enjoy this you want to see more Days Gone I am absolutely loving this game, Zombie Apocalypse Survival Game if you don't know anything about it uh, do be sure to hit that like button, subscribe if you're new and if you want to cop some of that fire merch head on over to typical dot store link in the description below so we're gonna go ahead and uh, do this mission right here uh, it's a rifle not a gun learn to track deer from Copeland and a little bit before uh, we started here I actually got this mission which is track down neuro agent O'Brien so uh, the radio that we stole from the last uh, walkthrough or the, the one they left behind the uh, neuro agents um, we actually heard a transmission and that they're gonna be meeting over here and that's how we have that mission I just didn't get to record it so uh, we're headed over to this Copeland mission first where we get to learn how to track deer which should be good I mean uh, we haven't really got to interact with animals too much in this game yet living or zombie animals but uh, I'm excited well we did fight a zombie bear so you want to learn how to hunt Is that what I'm hearing I know how to shoot a gun it's a rifle not a gun I was in the 10th mountain cope don't give me any marine corps bullshit <laughs> killing a buck's a little different than killing a man or a freak Best way to hunt an animal is to track it. Okay. You gotta focus and see what nature's trying to tell you. If you look hard enough, you'll see the signs. I still wonder if he got attacked by a bear. You see that like distinct scar on his face? Oh, they want me to go ahead and there we go. What do we see here? It's a patch of grass. Oh. We're having visions. I see the deer, Copeland. Let's go follow the deer. Come on now. Is that we're going to be a grade A hunter? We got to follow it to the next clue. The mini map in the bottom right is super helpful too. It kind of shows you well, where okay. to go. Oh. Look hard. Is that some is that some dung? It's oh. Yeah, I see it. They lead this way. <laughs> yeah, I can see that. Well, come on, man. Well, come on, man. I see the deer. I'm looking at it. Let me take the shot, Cope. There's your buck. I see him. Now here, use my rifle. If you were in the tenth mountain, you know how to use a scope. Okay. Give me that. I'll take it now. Thank you. Yeah. It's teaching you, how, teaching you how to snipe. That's what it's doing. All right. Let's go ahead and equip the sniper. I got this. Come on. You got this. Poke your head up one more time. I need to use focus. The game didn't expect to do that, did it? Got him. Nah, come, Shit, on. come on, come on. Okay. Track quarry. You have unlocked track quarry. The ability to track a wounded deer. Look for the blood trail. You can tap R3 to use survival vision and hold square to search a clue. Oh, God damn it! It wasn't a kill shot. He got away. Oh, no. That's okay. You wounded him. He'll bleed out soon enough. We just gotta track him. Okay. All right, let's do it. That's such an interesting. I I didn't think there would be a a somewhat in depth um, hunting system. Like Red Dead's was pretty good. Let's see how this one compares. And follow him. On it. So we gotta follow the uh, the bloody trail here. Oh. Oh, he definitely slowed down quite a bit. Okay. You know how to gut an animal? Yeah, look. Cope, Boozer and I have been hunting before. He used to go elk hunting with his old man and yeah, he uh, he showed me how to gut a deer. Well, there you let's go. Just say no disrespect to Boozer, but you got a lot to learn. <laughs> You're wasting a lot of meat there. Ooh. For all, not bad for a beginner. Okay. Yeah, thanks. Kind of like Copeland. He's not that mean, you know. I kind of frame it. I, I think he's a good guy. I think he's an overall good guy. Hopefully. <laughs> like, ten episodes down the road, I'm like, I hate Copeland. Yeah, Copeland's the guy I hate. Yeah, so the hunting's not, uh, there's no, like, wind or anything like that, or... Now, I'll take back that rifle. 
Here, thanks. Like I said, Deke, we can always use more venison at the camp. Still got some folks trying to heal up from that Ripper attack. Okay, Cope. Yeah, I'll see if I can remember that. So, essentially there, we went hunting in the zombie apocalypse. It's a rifle, not a gun. Easy 3,000 XP. Nothing too crazy. We got some more respect there, or whatever they want to call it. Alright, so we got to do making contact. Uh, which is this one over here. We're just going to drive it. I mean, I was going to fast travel, but screw it. We're going to hit the open road in our beautiful bike here. It's only a thousand meters away. That's not too bad. What would a thousand meters be in, uh... I know a lot of you guys aren't familiar with those terms. since we did any hunting. I'll see if I can scare up some meat while I'm out. Remember what you're doing. <laughs> yeah, I had Cope give me a few pointers. There you go. Oh, shit. Don't believe it. Thanks, Dean. There you go. Well, you know what? Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. You know, I I did kill a bear, so so let's let's say that that should be enough meat forever. I grew up in these here woods. He teaches me how to hunt, and now he's doing a freaking hunt podcast. Oh, this is the creepy spot. Oh no, don't like this. That's a lot of bodies. Oh. We got you covered. Grandfather also taught me to catch a doe. Sometimes you gotta lay an ambush. Hide where they need to go. Like a watering hole. Today, you're as likely to be prey as hunter. Granddaddy taught you a lot, huh, Coke? So was that actually a tip I can use or no? Oh. Let me tell you. What the heck that guy back there? This is Mark Copeland for Radio Free Oregon. Don't believe the lies. So if I put a trap near Trina, come back a day later. You and your granddaddy said Love when my dude just yells sometimes. That's hilarious. <laughs> just starts yelling. Right. Now, all these have been stealth missions. Infiltrate the Nero landing zone. How far off is it? All right, it's fairly close. And if it wanted us truly to be on the bike. Oh, Nero soldiers researchers wear special armored hazmat suits and are immune from your attacks. Use stealth tactics. Let me just mark them all so that I know where they are. I can't actually take them out or anything, so. I think I have to be within earshot to uh, listen to them, so. There's not too many bushes near here. Oh, there's this guy here. I didn't even see him. Could have been bad. Yeah, I don't think I can hide in those bushes. Oh, shoot. Alright, I'm going to go to that section there. It's about the closest I think I'm going to get. Or I can hide up against that log. Uh, wants me to go down there, huh? Come on! That's too risky, man. Hey, Sarge, how about we make an unscheduled stop on our way back? A couple of sample traps I want to check. Hey, Doc, how long before your job's done? We're going to go around here. Hard flank.
Oh, no. Oh, bro, I didn't... I'm right in the path here. Let's get a rock out, or trusty rock, just in case we need it. We can always throw it to distract people. I want to get over to those bushes there. Yeah, damn it. So close. Anyone else hear that? We're booking it. Lieutenant O'Brien, field note two zero zero six. On approach to the landing site, I observed a large swarm of insects, probably Dimonosotrotus or Diptera, in a clearing well away from our designated target. From that distance, I cannot discern what was attracting the insects, but from the size of the swarm, recent carry is indicated. Should be just over. Damn it, where is it? Stealth missions are so stressful. Cause like you know if they see you at all, you're done for. Speculation as to Tomatis Atronis is confirmed. Okay, I wanna make it to that bush, but I don't want him to turn. Confront O'Brien. All right, this should get really interesting because O'Brien was the last person we knew that was uh, near our wife before things went down. All right, O'Brien. I'm sorry, buddy. I got to talk to you. I won't be mean. Don't leave it this way, you poor son of a bitch. At least you weren't torn apart by freaks. If you lived a few more weeks, you might have become one yourself. Now, what would have happened something? Ooh, smart. Uh -oh. uh, what do you want? Stay back. I just want to talk. Uh, Nero Protocol 2-7 states clearly that uh, if conducting operations in quarantine zones, if I encounter any civilians or sub civilians, that I'm forbidden from making contact. Really? See, that sounded to me like <laughs> making contact. <gasps> yes. Yes, it did. You're alive. Yes, I am. How? How are you alive, What? I, I, I don't understand. Okay, you were there that night. Farewell. The next it's night, with Nero camp, Protocol 2 the 7 were states. The I, Everyone was dead. They were slaughtered, seven. torn limb Nero for goddamn limb. Protocol All right, listen up. We're going to do this the easy way or the hard way. The easy way, we have a little chat. You give me the information that I need, and then you go back to digging your way through freaker shit or whatever the hell else you're doing out here. The hard way. Crack open that little spacesuit, and then we see what your friends out there have to say about you breathing in all this contaminated air. So what's it gonna be, O'Brien? <laughs> that <Yes>. face. <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> you remember the rooftop of the old brewery? I put a woman on your chopper, she was wounded. Yes. I remember, a, a knife wound. She, she was cut pretty bad. I went to the refugee camp that you said you were taking her to. Everyone was dead, so I'm going to ask you again. How did you survive? We weren't there. We were diverted south to another camp. Oh. Like you said, the camp in Belknap was overrun, so they moved us south to a camp outside of Silver Lake. Were there survivors? You mean now? I don't know. I... I was transferred to the research unit. Did she survive? Oh, wait, 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 wait. I, 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 I can find out. I, I can check. You, you have one of our radios. That's how you... Uh, I, I can't promise anything, but I'll, I'll check. Uh-huh, and I'm going to go with you. No, Come on. You, you can't. Please, you don't... Hey, don't understand. I'll fucking shoot you. Not before I shoot you. Okay, look, if you're going to fucking kill me, do it, okay? I did my job. Did the woman, your wife... I put her on oxygen, I gave her an IV. I kept her alive. I got in a lot of trouble for that. She was septic, she wasn't gonna make it, but I got out of the mass unit. I saved her goddamn life. O'Brien, we... report. We like you, O'Brien. We like O'Brien. I have to go. Please, you have to get out of here. You don't know these men. You don't know Brian, what they're capable of. If I don't hear from you. I don't care how long it takes. I'm gonna track you down, and I'm gonna do a lot worse than snap off an antenna. I'm sorry about your wife, but you're not the only one who lost someone that night. Damn. So now we really don't know if she's alive.
That's it's like good news. Kind of, right? It's definitely good news. Just confuses things a little bit. We're getting low on meat story job. New objective. Hunt animals. <laughs> right. Is he alive? They were diverted south. He said that he put her on oxygen. He gave her an IV. He kept her alive. She was septic, so she wasn't going to make it, but he got her to a mass unit. He saved her life. He said it. He said he saved her life. She, she can still be. She, no, 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 no. But O'Brien is alive. If he is. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. If we go into photo mode, can we? Oh, you can only go so far in photo mode, huh? Oh, I want to see all those zombies down there. They're, they're terrifying. Look how many zombies there. There's a freaking horde. Do we have a, oh, we don't have any. I guess we can use our binoculars. Deke, you there? Who's man? Um, a few days ago, I asked you if you remembered that Nero asshole. I don't like that. I don't like that. Uh, yeah, Deke, it's, it's all uh, kind of a blur. Yeah, yeah, okay. Get some shut eye booze, man. I'll, I'll tell you about it later. When are we riding out of here, Deke? Oh, soon, Boozer. Real soon. Look, <clears throat> as soon as your arm heals, we're gonna be riding the hell out of here. Yeah, Deke. Okay. Okay, look. If I hunt this deer, I think it should count, right? Okay. Find the carcass. Hey, hey, hey! Stop running! I Whoa. shot you. Are you out there, O'Brien? Oh, oh, son of a bitch! You better radio me. You hear me, O'Brien? I have to take out five You're of them. This channel, God damn it! Okay. Deacon, you it was just. Get back to me, or I'm going to track you down. You got that? Deacon's impatient, man. God damn it! Oh, come on! Ryan, get back to me. Okay, here it's been we like go. two seconds. Okay, so we gotta hunt more animals. Um, oh, it's kind of giving us a spot to go, but I want to get my motorcycle. How do you get? Bike is too far to recover. Oh. Okay, so we gotta run back to our bike. Isn't that exactly when you'd want to recover it if your bike is too far? Am I crazy? Uh, so it's showing me different animal spots, I think. I want to get my bike, though. Are those people? Oh, great. Oh, I don't want to mess with them. I may just, like, let me get my bike and I'll be on my way. How far are we from our bike? Oh, we're not too far. But, like, running on no stamina. We have to just wait for it to come back. Blue bar in the bottom left. Yeah, so that mixes things up of us not knowing uh, if her wife made it or not. But I mean, it's a good thing. At least she's not... She's like... I mean, they're both pretty sure she's not around, but uh, she might be alive, maybe. We don't know. Alright, let's hop on this. Oh, it seems like... It seems like it shows animals like really close by. Maybe when, even when they spawn or something. We're gonna go on foot. I feel like we're gonna scare them away if we, if we don't. Oh shoot! A wolf is literally eating a dude. Okay, you know what? Okay. I don't like this very much. My accuracy don't. Yeah, yeah, come here. I need my last wolf. Woo! Okay, I got all three. That worked out. My accuracy was not <laughs> was not the wave there, but one of the camps can use this. There we go. And then we need the last one, and we're good. I'm glad. I thought this mission was going to be a pain. Oh, it's getting progressively darker. 
All right, we saw a wolf eat a zombie. All right, back to booze man we go. I think that's, uh, yeah, that's where we're headed here. I actually really like the, um, it's kind of intuitive. Why does my bike make no noise? Yo, I got like a Tesla bike. You guys hear this? Oh, gosh. I think I broke it. Let me hop off on it. Let me hop on it again. There we go. Honestly, I should have checked if it was uh, making any sound or not still. I can't see anything. It's like foggy and rainy. And very bad driving conditions right now. Very... Oh, shoot. It was a zombie right there. Oh, this is really cool. But not an actual situation I would want... You know, this whole thing's not an actual situation I'd want to be in, but... This right here, this, this time of day... With these weather conditions, definitely not something I'd want to be a part of. No way. It's like almost calming. Oh, great. They sound like pigs. Don't they? Like squealing? What the freakers sound like? Alright, let's fill up the, uh... Fill up the bike while we're at it. Oh, wait, wait hold up. It gave me the option while I was on the bike. Ooh. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> it's pumping gas. You could pump gas in the zombie apocalypse. It's all good. Okay, let's hop out and let's go talk to Booze Man over here. We definitely got to catch up on some uh, ammo as well. All right, buddy. Don't, don't, uh... Oh, okay. You're awake. Wow. Yeah, it's hell out there. It's gonna get cold tonight. Yeah, I can feel it. That's why hey, the weather changed, man. see? I brought in some meat. Should keep us stocked up for a while. Hey, Deke, thanks, man. I'm <laughs> not real hungry right now. I'll salt it up in a bit. Oh, he's not looking very good, guys. He's like sweating and everything. Oh, boy. They won't let me leave. Story mission. Okay. So let's go ahead and get some more ammo here. Some supplies. Molotov. Ooh. Molotov, pistol ammo, bolts, rifle ammo. All right. So this mission over here, check in on Lisa. Um, let's go ahead and we'll probably fast travel to this camp here. Let's fast travel there. The thing is that fast traveling is quite expensive on fuel, and then you have to buy the fuel when you're there, which costs like 200 credits, which I guess isn't too bad. Like I mentioned like in, in the last episode, in these games, I typically tend to have like a lot of money when the game's completed. So like I've found using fast traveling is a, is a better way of dealing with things because, you know, it, it, it is fun to drive to each location, but it's also fun to get right into the missions and right into the, uh, the core of the game. But... I guess when we get the really souped up motorcycle, we could just thoom across over. And I do like driving most locations, especially if they're like somewhat nearby. So there's that. There we go. Oh, we didn't use all our fuel. We have 28%. I really don't want to know what happens when you run out of fuel, though. It's okay. And you're out in the middle of nowhere. Did you track down the chopper? Was it the same guy the one we saw on the roof that night? Uh, yeah. Yeah, it, it was him. Remember us, Sarah. What happened? I don't know. They got diverted south for some reason. Didn't say that line. I do like how some of the missions change it to like a daytime or whatever. You know the uh, the developers thought was the best mood for said mission. I hope Boozer's all right, man, because that's a really bad burn, and I'm I honestly don't know too much about burns. Um, I mean, he's holding up pretty good, right? You're sweating there. That's that's probably not a good sign. His buddy fighting off something. How you doing, kid? They won't let me leave. Who would you want to leave? It's safe here. I have to work. <laughs> okay. Okay. 
Well, that was an easy mission. <laughs> Leveled up from that. Got 500 trust. Select skill point. Uh, what should we put it in? Can we unlock. I don't think we did this yet. Kill smaller enemies after successfully escaping grapple. I hardly ever get grappled, so. Uh, I kind of want the ability to repair melee weapons with scrap. That would actually be really good. Or we can get a ranged one. When in focus, ranged weapons will have an increased power to stop weaker enemies. That would be really good, actually. Let's get that one. We'll actually unlock the third tier from that. Oh, enemies will have an increased chance to be stunned when they are hit by ranged weapons. Alright, not exactly what I thought, but... It says increased power to stop weaker enemies, and the other thing said something differently. Which is a bit weird. I kind of want to do knocked up. Significantly increases crossbow bolt damage. I feel like that would be a good one. Alright. Throw over working my girl here. I think uh, Tucker had another mission for me, so let's hit her up. Deke, uh, I, I need you to go after someone. Go Come on. After someone. Okay, what's going on? Right after you brought in that girl, Lisa. Larson brings in another one. Name was Rose Allen, a weak little thing. But we figured she could pull her own weight, help us get this irrigation ditch done. Uh, okay, so what do you, what do you need? She's gone. She, she went on a supply run with Alki. Some others up to that abandoned Nero refugee camp. Hmm. You know the one? I, I think you've been up there before. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah I know the one. Find her, Deke. There's been a bunch of drifters and squatters spotted up that way. If, if they find her first. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna see what I can do. All right. So we have a new job unlocked. Now I'm curious. Do I have a main mission right now? Oh. So I have that job, and then I also have the side mission here. I think I have to do the job though. So I don't think I actually have a like main main mission right now. Side mission, job, side mission, zone, zone, camp, checkpoint. Yeah, I think it's this one. I'll probably have to do that one. So we selected that one and then we have to head up there. I think there was a gas tank on the way. Oh yeah, see that was that was the um the radio tower that we looked at previously. Oh, is this where my bike was? Whoops. And I'm pretty sure there's a gas tank on the way, so we can just fill up for free. We don't gotta pay the the mad amount of credits that this guy wants. You here for your bike? No, I'm not here for my bike, bro. Not here for the gas either, okay? Hold on. Can't okay. can't afford your expensive gasoline. Let's see if I remember where it was. And I wanna see if it dynamically like stays in one spot. Uh, yeah, yeah, it, it was him. Did he remember us? Sarah, what happened? I don't know. They got diverted south. He he remembered her, but he doesn't know what happened. Yeah. I, 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 no. No, look, I'm not stupid, loser. I just want to find out, you know, what happened to her. Where she died. Are you kidding me? You're still coming? Bro, I just want the gas tank. I will kill all you freakers. I I just want I literally just want the gas tank. Go the other way. Y'all really y'all really want to die, huh? Yeah, you turn around, lady. Get the heck away from me! Now you get. Two by Ford. More bounties. I do appreciate the bounties, though. Easy money. Easy money. What? Okay. Rebel Rock Cave. Yeah, might as well go in there, right? See what's up. I do like how the fuel cans are. Um, they give you max gasoline if you if you use them to fill up. It's pretty nice. You don't have to go around finding like separate fuel tanks to complete a tank of gas, right? Let's go see what's up over here, though. I wish I could carry more ammo. I think that's probably a uh, 
an option eventually. Chat. Just so we know, this is a bad idea, right? Oh, there's a million zombies in here. Oh, there's a million zombies in here. There's literally a million zombies in there. Oh, no. They were all chilling. They were all sleeping or something. These guys are fast, bro. Hey, you need to move. You need to move. Please, you, I, you really don't want none. Ow. Ow, 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 ow. I literally have no stamina. Ooh. I was really relying on my stamina there. I'm gonna have to dig out the pistol here. How are you kidding? Eat two by four. Just die already. Oh my gosh. You know, I was good to get away on my bike there, and then some dude was just... He's messing around with my bike. Why was he there? All right. Well, we'll definitely go into that cave at a later part of the game. Yeah. For now, we're just gonna we're just gonna forget that cave exists. Okay. We're just gonna put that cave behind us. We're just we're gonna forget it exists because uh, I think I'm slightly traumatized that I ran into a cave full of zombies. Alright, let's put the uh, pedal to the metal here. Well, I don't think that term applies to uh, Deacon St. John to bikes. Hot springs. Talk to you there. Yeah, Deke, I'm here. Hey, I'm at that location where the girl was last seen. Looks like they uh, got hit by a swarm. If she was here, probably not much chance she's still alive. If she is, you'll find her. Tuck her out. Great. Oh, this is nice. Come from a swarm of frickin' zombies in a cave. Of these dudes just chilling, Living their best lives. Alright, you know what I'm gonna do? Because I haven't used... I only have two. Is there any explosives near here? Like, I'd love to take them out silently. I just don't think that's gonna happen. Let me if I can throw a rock right here. Oh, no, no. Why are you guys all coming closer? I just want one. Yep. Alright, one at a time. One at a time. Oh, chill, chill, chill. Oh, you ain't seen nothing. Oh, I feel like she definitely saw something. Oh, shoot. I'm sorry, did I kill your friend? I'm so sorry. It was just... She's bobbing and weaving, dog! She's bo I just talked about... Country roads! Why are you so good at dodging? Okay. Got you. Oh, he just got. I appreciate that move I upgraded now. I appreciate the move I upgraded to make him stumble. Saved my life. Literally saved my life. Here, let me go ahead and get a bandage here. Man. The zombies in this game are so freaking hard. That's why if there's like a group of like 10 of them, there's almost no way to kill them unless you like group them all up in Molotov. But I don't even think the Molotov takes out more than like a couple at a time. 
we still got a couple of them alive. What do we got here? What do we got? There we go. Do we have upgrades for? Ooh, spike two by four. Let's go ahead and make that. There we go. I didn't even know I could make that. It's pretty neat. All right, this is what we're gonna do. We're gonna distract one of them by sending them over there. Take out our two by four. Sorry, <laughs> spike two by four. Okay. Let's take a look around. Yoink. Yoink. Are you trying to 1v1 me? Let's go! Let's go! What happened to you, Rose? That's it. She ran at me, bro. Oh, we got some more residue here. Does the residue respawn? I wonder. Lawnmower machete. Oh, there's some evidence. Is this evidence? Okay, let's see. What's going on here? Gotta examine the body. Yep, it's pretty. I mean, might be here somewhere, right? Let's be real. It's going up that tower, right? Who are we fooling? What is this? Oh, Jesus, looks like the swarm tore him apart. <laughs> Poor bastards. Darn. All right, looks like their footsteps went. Would you look at that? Up here. All right. Well, up we go. Oh, I hear people. I mean, this should be okay, right? Like, what are the odds, like, a freaker gets up there? Can they even climb? Rose, Rose Allen, right? No. No. Hey, 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 hey. I'm not going to hurt you. See? I'm... Uh, not with those assholes. Yep. No. no! God damn it, I'm here to help. Tucker sent me. Wait, wait, I said that I am here to help you. No, you're with her. You're from the work camp. No, no, I'm with Tucker. Uh, I, I do runs for, yeah. They starved me. I wouldn't follow her orders, so they wouldn't feed me. Oh. Well, I mean, it's a work camp. I mean, everyone's got to work. <laughs> I'm not a slave. I'm not going back, do you hear me? Damn. I'd rather die out here. Okay, 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 goddamn. Copeland's camp. Send her off. Go on. No, no, send her to Copeland's camp. We need more cope credits. Oh, well, we earned some stuff for the hot springs there. Protecting the weak. Gear up for the ride. We unlock some custom skins. Ooh, hot springs encampment custom accent. Ascent? How do you pronounce it? Yeah, oh, we got some correct. gear up here. Sweet. Can we hop on our bike from here? No, there's no option to recover the bike from here. So what is this? This is a side mission. I don't see us having a main mission yet, so I assume it's going to say in a second. Someone's going to call us up or something. Visit Sarah's Memorial Stone. I swear we just did that, right? I guess you got to keep going back for some reason. It's like he loved his wife or something weird, right? But, like, there's always going to be zombies protecting it. And honestly, we ain't got that much bullets left. I don't know how many car parts we can use as uh, makeshift silencers, you know? Alright, well, we bodied every zombie out here. Glad there were actually there was the the freaker nest the first time we went through right. That's about the only thing. The rest was pretty a okay. Now we could do that or we could do the. Let's do an ambush camp actually. That might do us better. And then hopefully another mission will pop up. Because if we go to storylines, there's nothing um. Nothing too crazy. No main missions for us to do. Actually, you know what? Let's do the side mission. Side mission might activate the main mission after. Oh, wow. It is slidey. Oh, no. There's zombies here. Are you 
kidding me. Bro. Oh, come on. You didn't hear nothing. Oh. Do you really want some? Like, I'll stop and we can do this. We can dance, bro. We can dance. Honestly, I think we're okay to just stroll in. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna just stroll in. There we go. Look at that. Blast from the past, baby. Let's go. There are not nearby enemies to talk to us here. Oh, shoot. Who are you? You ain't my wife? Actually, it was my wife. Rip. JK. What did you take out here? Ooh, what is this? What the heck happened here? <laughs> Honestly, that kind of worked out. Got some ammo. All right. Uh, hey, me again. Boozer says that I shouldn't come up here anymore. He keeps asking me what goods I do, and, and maybe he's right. I don't know. He got hurt pretty bad the other day. We ran into some rippers who burned the hell out of his arm, and it looks pretty bad. I it does look pretty bad. Uh, uh, what the hell do you call them? The mobile medical units? I mean, I got them sterile bandages. And I hope it's enough, you know? But Boozer, you know, he says he's fine, but I, I, don't, I don't think so. Ooh. She looks pretty bad to me. See, the thing is, it was on me. Ooh. I risked his life for a bike part. Goddamn bike part. You kind of did. Not that it mattered. Son of a bitch Copeland parted it out anyway. It wasn't really his fault, though. <sighs> it took me a year to put that bike together. You would have liked it. It's not as nice as the one that I taught you to ride on, but it got me around. You remember that tank that you had painted for me? Well, that was the only thing left of that old hog, and... Now it's gone too. As soon as I get it back together, I, the, my bike. I mean, I can get Boozer patched up. We're gonna ride north. Fresh start. Got a lot of memories around here. Too many. Anyway, I guess I'm just saying that uh, I might not see you again. Aww. No. Jeez. That's rough. That's real rough. Honestly, I hope I like he can't leave now. He has to stick around to see if he finds his wife. Like he has to give it his all, right? He has to see what Brian says. What is this? Oh. Oh yikes. Okay. <laughs> Freaking yikes. Let's get back to our, our bike here. We gotta fill her up. We only use premium gasoline, all right? Oh, I think we're missing the bike there, but you know what? Let's book it. All right, so we've done all the main quests that we can see right now. What is this over here? Oh, Neuro Research Site. So that's one of them I still gotta go to. I still gotta do this side quest here. Let's do this right over here, though. The Ambush Camp Hunter. I believe some of the main missions only trigger, like, if a certain amount of daytime passes or or something like that. Because, like, we don't have any main, main story missions now. But I think if you just give it a little bit of time. Oh, okay. Are they weaker at night or stronger at night? I think they're weaker at night for some reason. We're just not going to test that theory. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh. Okay, wow. That was not YouTube loading for you. That was actual game. Stuttering. That was the first time it stuttered that bad. Nick, you there? I got bored. I figured I'd see if I remembered how to make anything. Stop by when you can. Ooh. Ooh, thank you. Yeah, I'll stop by when I can. Out. Sweet. So we made us something. That zombie just disappeared in the middle of the road. Tucker, you can say John to. You can say John to Ada Tucker. Deke, did 
Where'd you find her? Uh, yeah. See, I'll talk. I found her, and uh, she's on her way back. Wait. You let her go? Alone? Well, she took one of the squatter's bikes. She said that she was going to be able to find her way. She, look, she didn't want my help. Ah, oh, God damn it, Deke. You should have brought her in. Well, why, Tuck? Why? Is there something wrong? I mean, is there some reason she wouldn't want to come back? <laughs> no. No, of course not. It's just... A kid like Rose, she doesn't have a goddamn clue about what's out there. Well, yeah. I don't know, Maybe she does. St. John out. Yeah, I don't know. I don't, I don't think I like her camp. I think she runs a pretty tight ship, but I think it's... Uh... She might work people a little too hard. So there is 15 enemies in this camp. I so far have spotted five of those enemies. So this should go over well. Can't go up over there. Can this guy turn around or something? I just hucked a hell of a rock over there. Is that a rock? Oh yeah, that's a rock, bro. Men coming. Oh shoot. First one down. Now the rest of you. Oh. I don't think he sees me, this guy. Okay. So we've taken out three of them. I have a feeling this guy knows what's up. He knows what's up. Like, he's looking directly in my direction here. Kind of scaring me. That's all of them. Well, you didn't even find a body. This is kind of tripping out, huh? What the? the? I'm glad I got that move that uh, makes me completely silent when I drop off things, or that would have been very unstealthy. Very, very unstealthy. All right, let's head through here. I got a frag grenade from that guy. I only have four bullets, and there is 11 more people. <laughs> the math is not adding up here. Are you kidding me? Why are you looking this way? I know if I even bolt him in the head, the bolt doesn't do enough damage at the moment. I'm gonna huck that thing. Look. Uh. Uh, a rock? Yeah, bro. You think zombies throwing rocks nowadays? Oh shoot. Hey. Yeah. Oh. Grab cover. Yeah. What do you think now, huh? Somebody shoots back. How do you like that? Honestly, the bolt actually just one shot that guy. <laughs> do you hear that lady? What is he doing running around like that? Oh. Oh! Bolts OP! Oh, you ain't seen nothing, lady. I love how they say that's all of them when I'm... S like, there's no indication that I'm done for. Is this guy going up for it? Oh. Oh, shoot, lady. You shouldn't have come over here. He gave, he, honestly, he gave her some bad intel. She should be hella mad at him. Dude, this guy went to an interesting spot. Because it kind of like sets him up to get shanked. Be 
quiet. Okay, there you go. See? Okay, there's uh, only a few more of them here. Cleared out a good portion of them. Okay, look. I should be able to crossbow this guy in the back of the head, right? Let's do a test. Okay. See? See why I have trust issues? Oh, shoot. Oh, sh that dude just shot me through a wall? Son of a bitch! Oh, chill. Okay. You can't hide, you son of a bitch. Okay, I don't appreciate that at all. Hold up. Nope, medical. And bolt. Run away. Oh, you have a helmet. That's a little cheap. Okay, I can't beat this dude's wearing armor and stuff. We out. Damn it, Tuck, you shouldn't have. Here you are. No, he's taking the rest of our drugs and okay. headed north. My boys lost him somewhere around Marion Forks. All right, I'll see if I can track it down. One shot is all I need. Possibilities. I wish I could find some more ammo on people. Oh, chill. Oh, my Come lady, on. chill. Honestly, I'm gonna be a pro player of this game. I see you running around. Oh, what you got, bro? What you got on, huh? Give me that armor. Give me that gun too while we're at it, bro. It doesn't even have ammo in it. He was on his last limb. Oh my gosh. I really need ammo. Honestly, this person... What are they doing? Why are they looking into the sky? This is this wasn't a very competent camp. At least this guy wasn't. This is what you get. Okay, you know what? Now we're doing a test. Look, we're right behind this guy, right? Is that it? Is that all you got? I think you gotta aim a little yeah, higher. That's what I, thought I shot him in the time. jugular. You set up an ambush. Don't pick on the wrong guy. There bunker. you go. Yeah, I bet they had a bunker. Just gotta find it. I know exactly where the bunker is. Oh, wait a second. Was this burning this whole time? Oh, shoot. Okay. We got some freakers that have found their way here. Bunker. Yes. Here it is. I'm going to ignore that they exist. Oh, no. no. I would like to continue to ignore their existence. Just go ahead and open the bunker, please. This is Radio Free Oregon. The truth shall set you free. Oh, the gun went down there as well. You probably don't remember the Cold War. But living through it was a special kind of hell. Every time you heard a plane flying overhead, you'd think for sure that this is it. That's the one coming to drop the big one on us. And we lived through the Red Scare. The man didn't know if his neighbor was an American Ooh, who played red, white, and blue. Or a communist red... Oh, we got a map. Made it hard to trust. My father... Bear Creek Hot Springs Ambush Camp. Got the XP, got the trust. Ooh, craft recipe unlocked. Smoke bomb. God rest nice. Him. Taught me the only way to be safe in dark times was to go underground. Great. Built my first bunker with him. Now this dude's telling us he's building bunkers and stuff. How much does filling ammo cost? Oh, sure. Oh, what the heck? Oh, that sucks. You can't fill ammo for your primary if you don't have it in your locker. With Rip. Had to go out into the woods, from the road, where no one yeah, is that what you had to do, Copeland? It's very funny he's talking about bunkers as soon as I entered the bunker. A little bit too perfect timing, if you ask me. That's what I'm going to say. As we, 
we, we had to sleep it off, right? There was a lot of zombies in the area. We didn't we didn't like that energy. Okay. Let's go. As you know me, I like noon extra sunny. Uh, that's my vibe. Constantly on a noon extra sunny vibe. Is there anything else I can pick up here? Oh, there was. Oh, that's the bunk bed. Or the, the bunk, rather. Alright, let's head up here. I do like how these areas become bases for you. And I believe you can fast travel to them. And we can see that example with... I think I did one over here, right? Yeah, see? You can fast travel on it. Which is pretty neat. Okay, so uh, this is a storyline mission. The rest of our drugs locate Roach. So bike required for the job. So let's go get our bike. We kind of left the bike uh, a little bit ways away. I don't like to bring it awfully close to the camp because uh, I feel like they're going to notice it. And then that makes my life a lot harder when trying to uh, interject in their, in their business. There's really not a lot of ammo here. I think if I pick up the AK though... And I go to each body. I'm going to have to buy that gun. Because actually, that gun's really, really good. Wait, which one did he have? Sonoff. Yeah, I don't think Sonoff's going to work out for me, Chief. I think some of these people had more of that gun, though, right? No, nobody had it. M7. And I'm going to get to this guy. He's going to have the AK. Yeah. <laughs> okay, Whatever. Whatever. We'll make do with this. Whee! Right, let's hop on our bike. I think I could push this car out of the way. Maybe not. Oh, yes, I can. Make it a lot easier. I mean, I guess it'd be good if we, this was like a safe space. But we don't really care about this camp. We got a lot of other camps, you know? Bear Creek Hot Springs. Actually, it's a pretty neat camp. Not gonna lie. Intruders will be shot. Yeah, I, honestly, they weren't lying. I got pretty shot. Oh, is that a deer? Deer crossing. Wow, that's not too smart, even without the traffic. Okay, why was there like eight deer? Honestly, I'm getting these deer. Let's go, baby. You versus me. Holy shoot. Mother of Pearl. Oh, my Jesus. I'm running away now. That terrified me. Honestly, I'm low-key inclined to help these zombies because these wolves are absolutely jacked. And... Just scared the living daylights out of me. Alright, it's a 1v1 situation. Not looking good for team... If you're team zombie... I'm sorry. Yeah, okay, that's what I thought. <laughs> that took way too many shots. I think when they're in the animation of taking out a zombie, it actually doesn't let you to do any damage to them, which is odd, but you know what? I guess it's a thing. And now, to us goes all the spoils, aka all of these deers. What an angle, huh? This is the angle we wanted. The clutch up angle. We'll never be able to get this many deer. I don't know why so many spawned. I guess they were like trapped against the side here. Now I guess if he if he ever asked for meat again, we'll just be like, yeah, we have like 50 deer on us. Is that enough for you, boozer? He's like, yeah, man, why you gotta be so defensive? Alright, let's take that. Alright. We're golden. We have like no ammo because we have to take out the unstoppable wolf. But now we're heading on to the mission here. And I'm loving this game so far. Let me know your thoughts as well. If you are watching and enjoy this, do be sure to hit that like button. Subscribe if you're new. And of course, if you want to cop some of that fire merch, head on over to typical.store. Link in the description below. Ooh, what a, what a little drift there. Is there an owl? 
Oh, this doesn't look good. What evidence do we see? Aha! Uh -huh. right. Where? Baller bars. Gotcha. Tucker, I spotted him, and it looks like he was uh, like he was waiting for someone. Deke, don't let him get away. Oh, I want boy. him alive. Oh, you want I'm him alive, don't shit, you? Tucker. I've. Sh I don't I have. Any bullets. I need him to tell us where he stashed it. So I need to okay, ram him. Alright, I'll see what I can do. Oh, come on, Roach. Where do you think you're going, huh? Still back here, you son of a bitch. Fine. Alright, let's do this the hard way. Nah, we really don't got bullets for Oh, who are you, bro? Switch targets. Tap L1 to switch targets. Ow. I'm oh wow. Okay, that guy just wiped out. That actually works out. I don't have ammo. Boy, Tucker sent you to, to talk. Yeah, oh, God damn it! If I wanted to kill you, you'd be dead. Uh, up your ass! I know what you done to Leon and Alvarez. Okay, I don't got any more bullets, bro. I gotta ram him. Okay, sir. Sir, you can't just wheelie like that, okay? Oh no. I, uh, I'm sorry other dudes chasing me. I literally don't have a single bullet to shoot. I use it all killing wolves. I'm sorry. Are you late for something? Where are you going? Oh shoot. The hell with you, St. John. He was thooming. I like how they call him St. John. What a name. Okay. We just gotta go for the ram, I guess. Okay, I rammed you, bro. Come on. Oh, there we go. You scrap to repair your bike. Approach the bike and hold circle to repair it. Oh shit! Not now. God damn it! Honestly, body that guy. Yo, I gotta repair it. Cranky, cranky, cranky. Don't let him get away, Deke. Done. Come on, come on, come on. I honestly had to mid-fight repair my bike. I couldn't repair it all the way either. I just had to do the bare minimum. I should have healed up too. That would have been a smart idea. Kill the really? You got more goons? Is this really necessary? I don't think this is necessary. I just want to take you in for light questioning. Oh my, bro, what does this guy have? He's got an Uzi. Great. Honestly, I'm cutting him off hard. Oh, oh I'm getting run over by a bike right now. Okay, hold on. First and foremost, you get this. I get this. I switched this. Don't let him get away, Okay. Okay, can you please just buzz off, bro? This really hurts what you're doing. I don't have the ammo or anything for this. One more ram and this other guy's dead, though. Alright, dude. Can you please leave me alone? I think he just trashed his own bike, so... I'm one hit away from my bike breaking, and so is his. We're going for a last-ditch effort. We have to guess if he's going left or right. He's going right. Oh, he's going straight. Oh, shoot. Really, dude? Oh, not through town. Yeah, he's gonna go left. Oh, oh. Bro, we led him into like eight zombies and like. Hey, Roach. How's it going, buddy? See? Told you I wasn't gonna kill you. Oh, Deke. No. No. Oh, I, I didn't do nothing. <sighs> nah, that's not what Tucker says. I guess when Leon and Alvarez took off with the camp's drugs, they forgot to cut you in. Is that about it? <laughs> Deke, no. Mm -hmm. 
No, no, no. Clue me in on what you're thinking, man. I, I want to understand. You, yeah, you, you can tell me, bro. Was left while the other one wasn't looking. Oh, Deke. Uh, I got nothing on me, okay? Search me. Uh. <laughs> no, I'm not. It's not my job. I'm going to leave that up to Alki. There we go. All right, I'm so glad it played like a cutscene when that ended there because uh, I wasn't going to okay, make it. I got him. Mark down these coordinates and have Alki sent him. what you did to Leon, okay, Dick? I, 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 alive? Please, man. Did Come he on, have please? my drugs? That'll hold. Well, yeah, he's alive, please, but please, if you want him to stay together, that way, Alki, you and me, we were friends. St. John out. Stop talking. Please, please. I don't want to die. Ah. Don't All right, well, out here. good luck out here. Oh, damn you. God Crazy damn question. You. Any idea where I can find a thunder egg? What the hell for? The kid I brought in, just trying to find a way to cheer her up. She mentioned having one. Shit, I don't know. Check the gift shop and build that crater. I don't even hear your forks. There we go. Yeah, okay. Thanks. All right. New mission unlocked. I brought you something. That should be it. We really don't have ammo, though, huh? Oh, we're really stuck over here. Okay, that was weird. <laughs> um, find the thunder egg at the visitor center. There's like really no spot for me to get ammo, huh? Okay, maybe we can ride around and find a police car or something. There could be a safe or something here. I mean, I'm down with using melee weapons, but... Honestly, while we're here... I just throw this Molotov and then we'll dip. We out! I love just throwing the Molotov in there and just dipping. Such an easy way to get it done. Like you don't have to stick around. Yes. Got to be right around here. Yeah. We're doing a fine job, if you ask me. Oh, I think some of them are still chasing me, by the way. There's two more nests around there. Don't worry, fellas. I'll be back later. Finish burning you out. That's the part. If you're doing it during the day... I don't remember if they said doing it during the day is better or not, but... There's some benefits, you know? What is this? Okay, then. Don't like that. Let's see if we can get her, uh... Whatever egg, I forgot what they're called. A whatever egg is the most scientific way Out I could put it. There ain't nothing but murdering drifters. Oh, Raiders. Ah! Oh, this. Chill. Oh. oh. I really don't got ammo for this. I'm not even gonna lie. That's why I rush him? Mm. Yeah. Uh, East stick. There we go. Woo. Yes, I told him to eat stick. Oh, that's a health cocktail. Let's craft some of these bandages. Thank you. All these bandages, actually. And I guess we gotta take this son off shotgun. What does he got for us? Should have had some pistol ammo. He had no pistol ammo. This guy not have a gun. This guy had a gun. There we go, two pistol ammo. We got some more stuff to uh, craft craft things with. Some gears. Help! Help! I need help! Yeah, bro, I'll help you out. Chill. Let me Ooh. get you out of there. You're not gonna make it out here. I know where there's a camp. I'll go, I'll go. Where? Show me, show me! Do I have to pick? I'm gonna get some to Copeland's. Peaceful Lake. Mark Copeland. It's safe there. Thank you so much for stopping. I was so dead. I was never getting out of there. Thank you. 
No problem, man. It was Deacon, Deacon St. John. I just keep running, stay off the road. There you go. See, I'm gonna send everyone Copeland's way. I feel like Copeland's the man. If it turns out Copeland's bad, I'm sorry to everyone I sent over there. I really am. But I couldn't have known that. Great. Now I have a sawn off shotgun. Okay, I really gotta upgrade. I really gotta buy that gun at uh, the non Copeland camp. What is this over here? I mean, while we're here, might as well get the historical landmark or whatever they are, right? Huh. Captain Jack, the Madoc Warrior. Probably pronouncing that wrong. Alright, let's get her to the rock. We're thooming it out here. Gift shop. Gotta be one in here somewhere. Alrighty. Ooh, a baseball bat? I actually will take the baseball bat. Because I can then affix it with some... Uh, some spikes, make it a metal, or a, oh, there we go. Oh, I got the thunder egg. Nobody believed in me, but I knew I'd get the thunder egg one day. And here I am, all thunder egged out. Can we fast travel there? Let's fast travel there. Yeah, I, I might just end up buying the, um... The AR from here because then I could just fill up the ammo. It was really good. It, it's a one shot headshot. It was easy to put a silencer on it. It's just like it had everything I needed in a weapon currently, you know, to take out these zombies and 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 the marauders and humans. I think they're called marauders. I don't remember, but but it's the good stuff essentially. The other weapons look cool, but they're all automatic weapons, and I don't see me picking up that much ammo. So I don't know if you guys play this differently, but. Or you guys would play it differently, but it's deep. Let him in. I do want to check out two things before we before we bring that in. So we are at Copeland's camp here. Or sorry, this isn't Copeland's. This is the other one. We can go to the kitchen. We have all this stuff. Let's sell everything to him. So we got the wolf meat. We got the deer stuff. That's all I got. We're so close to getting all the trust. We should get free, like, stuff if we get trussed up. And the mechanic guy here, I think he has... Oh, he does have new upgrades. Oh, oh you're out of gas. Oh, I guess he doesn't let you do anything unless you're higher trust, I would believe. And then the gun store over here. Hey. Hey, what's going on? You need something? Okay, this is the one. A thousand credits. I have eleven thousand credits. Like, I feel like I'm gonna go ahead and use that. See, I like the the rate of fire in the repeater. Isn't that bad? See, this one's full automatic. We don't need that. We that's too much. We don't need all that. Hmm. Requires a lot of headshots. Interesting. Oh my gosh, you can M get an MG45. <laughs> it's a little bit intense. This one seems good though. Effective medium to long range. But it's automatic. I feel like if you could change the rate of fire on them, I'm going to grab this one though. That's a good one. That is a good one. Thank you. I'm going to get a sidearm suppressor and a primary suppressor. Should help out in the shit. And pistol ammo. There we go. Yeah, right. So this is our, this is our, bro, what is your problem? Why are you aiming at me? Why are you being all weird? I'm going to attach a suppressor to it. There we go. Was that the gun we were using before? I think it was. Let's attach a suppressor to both of those. And let's visit our, our friend over here. Give her her rock. See what's up. Pardon me. Thank you. I hope she's doing good. 
feel bad we brought her here and now she's not liking it, you know? Lisa, I Go away. Oh no. Brush you something. That's beautiful. Will you take me with you? Take me back to Marion Forks. Um Look, I, I can't because it's not safe. I gotta turn in. They make us get up really early for work. She really not about it, huh? Yeah, understandably. Oh, we're, we're almost ranked two there. I've pulled weeds before. So what is this mission here? I pulled weeds before. It goes all the way back here. Flashback. Learn from Sarah how to gather lavender. Oh, man. The most exciting of missions. I guarantee it. <laughs> Learn how to gather lavender. I just can't wait to gather lavender. Ability to reload ranged weapon while sprinting significantly reduces ranged weapon recoil. Increases bolt damage. I'm gonna get that one actually. There we go. What what's what's next up over here? Okay, so crossbow bolt damage is significantly better. I wanna get that one. Ooh, interesting. Increases the ammo capacity of all ranged weapons. Increases projectile penetration for ranged weapons. Headshot kills recover health. Ooh. Alright, so we're gonna have to jump into like some of the other abilities. I was in my classroom. But like I dig the ones we got now, you know? You know, what? I'm gonna turn in just like her. Grab some shot eye. I'm gonna show we're one of them, you know? One of the people we we brought here. I mean That'd be tough, because I guess if if you go live at a camp like this, like everyone's got to pull their own weight, but it would just suck to be in this whole situation. She isn't going to survive that that much out there by herself, right? Like, come on. I guess it's a tough world out there. So I got to definitely use my um, my crossbow more often. Because now my crossbow is jacked. And craft some bolts. I have 11 bolts now. Plus, I got the special ones that I haven't really touched on, right? Do I have to go back to my bike to fast travel? Uh, see? There we go. Heading back through the country roads. Take me to home where I belong. Yeah, I'm curious what happens when you hit rank 2 of uh, trust or whatever it is. I can never remember the name, the little... The little thing you get for, you know, helping out a camp. Not the credits, the other thing. Don't remember what it's called, but... One of those, you know? One of those thingamabobbers. Let's drive this thing in. I love going back here because... It is so easy to refill. Copeland to Deacon St. John. We got a job for you. Hey, Copeland. Okay. Yeah, I'll stop by when I can. Deacon out. That's it. Deacon out. All right. Let's go up here and learn how to gather lavender. Woo! My favorite. You're not looking too good. I feel like a million bucks. Arms killing me. Yeah, I could see how your arm would be killing you, man. Hey, uh, you're not answering the radio. Yep. <sighs> I know, I was... Well, hold on, hold on, hold on. No, I'm alright, I'm alright. Just... I'm trying to get clear, you know? You're burning up. Ugh, my head's pounding like a mother. You're burning up. No, 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 I'm just, I'm just tired. Okay, stay here. Rest. I'll think of something. Look, I don't need a goddamn babysitter. I'm fine. Shit. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Think. Lavender. 
Take me home to the lavender roads where I belong. Sarah, help me find that lavender. He's about to become a herbologist. A nature guy. Eats specific like berries and stuff to cure his illnesses, you know? Honestly, anything to help Boozer at this point. Because Boozer's not looking so hot. He ain't talking so hot. He's starting to wobble left and right. That ain't good. We don't like that. Here, I'll show you what you're looking for. Uh, yep, found it. Uh, <laughs> all right, come on, focus. I am focused. All right, so this one is called Lavandula angustifolia. Lavender? Yes, well, I'm still paying off my student loan, so I will stick with Latin, mm -hmm. but you can call it <laughs> Yeah, get your money's worth. Go for it. <laughs> okay, come on, give me your hand. <sighs> All right, so you want to put one hand around the flower. All right. And then put the other hand at the stem. Okay. Just like that. And then you pull nice and slow. You know, I pulled weeds before. Uh, excuse me, sir. This is not a weed. You have to be gentle. Excuse me, sir. Oh, yeah, but not too hard. <laughs> okay, ready? Mm-hmm. Go. There you go. That's perfect. Yeah. <laughs> and it doesn't smell very good. Okay, you hold on to those, and I'm going to collect more. <laughs> so, uh... Oh, we get to walk around. Well, the guys at the lab are pretty excited. They, they think they have this subspecies, which might have mutated monoterpenoids, which produce a modified linalool that... That is so... Oh, my... Thank you, Einstein. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. It has a chemical that... We can use to synthesize a new medicine for burn patients. For burn patients, you say? The weed used for medicine is the kind that you smoke. You know, Boozer knows a guy with a farm. It's about three miles up the road. Oh, that's great. Boozer's going to wind up in prison and take you with him. <laughs> so what else do you guys make? Like chemical weapons, WMDs, shit like that? No, 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 no. Well, at least not me. Yeah? Ooh. It's in my contract. None of my research can be used for military purposes. Good stuff. Good st Honestly, her company probably created the zombie apocalypse. Let's be real. Hey, there's more over here. Wait, stop. Oh, come on. The water's yeah. going to be great. Hold, hold on. Hold on. What's wrong? Well, I, I didn't mean stop that. <laughs> come on. What is it? It's a long story. Well, that's okay. We can just walk. I like walking. So, what is he? Tommy Versetti? Can't swim? Plants. Really? Okay. Well, this particular genus is adventitious. You want me to ask? It means not native to this area. You can thank Ogden for that. Who? Oh, shit, I asked. Peter Skeen Ogden. First explorer to come through this part of Oregon. He and some of the other early explorers brought all their medicinal herbs and plants with them. Some got away, and now they're growing here. Mostly along the shores of small lakes and ponds. Great. First white explorer. Wow, look at you. Being all politically correct. Don't buy into all the biker stereotypes you see on TV. We are actually quite charming. I bet. The MC's got a couple of brothers. One fully patched. I don't think I've seen one person of color since I arrived in your strange little backwater paradise. Yeah, Jack actually had some guys bust in from Sacramento just to piss off our skinhead rivals. He did not. <laughs> no, he did not. I'm kidding. Jersey Jim's an old buddy of mine. Patched him and myself. We served in the same unit. Come by the clubhouse Sunday. I'll show you around. You like the guy. He's funny as shit. He makes a mean margarita. Margarita. Early on Monday, so. I'll have us back in your bed by 10. I promise. <laughs> How can I refuse an offer like that? Okay, you try picking some now. Lavender. You you want me to pick lavender? Yep. And bring me three plants and don't crush them. Oh, oh I ain't gonna crush nothing. <laughs> Come on. Uh, got one. Good for you. This one? Yep, keep going. I got three. I just bodied these Last lavender one. plants. Great, bring them here. She did not expect me to do that fast. I'm taking your job. Oh. Good for you. <laughs> Gallantry is alive and farewell after all. Oh, 
he's not, then I didn't kill him. <laughs> hey. Oh, 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 oh. Aww. Poor guys. Hey, is that the one we're going to smoke later? No, but this <laughs> is the one we're going to drink. I make this killer herbal tea with it. I'll bet. <laughs> hey. All right, if you come over, then I will make it for you as long as you give me a ride home. All right. Great. Well, you're going to be a believer. And we'll grab a beer for myself on the way over. <laughs> ah, I, mean, I hope she's not dead. He seemed happy with her, you know? Being his wife and all. Well, I mean, at that point, it wasn't his wife, but. You know, he learned a lot about plants. He's going to help booze her out with plants. It's good. It's good stuff. It's a lot of good stuff. We know that lavender grows near water. We've got to open our map and find a body of water of which lavender may be present, may or may not be present. I like how someone became a member while I was recording this. Shout out to Quentin. <laughs> Appreciate you. That's funny. Ooh. You see that? Watch out with newts with backpacks. They steal from you. I didn't know that. I pulled weeds before. You know, with my past. Give me a couple of days. Story job. Fine lavender. Where the heck? Can we... Fast travel there? To find some lavender real quick? You know, just find me a quick lavender or two. Uh, sorry, uh, I'm a little out of it. What, you, you said something? It's a, uh, it's something Sarah showed me a few seconds oh, ago. Oh, there's a bunch of them. Oh, before... Yeah. Anyway, uh, there's a plant that grows out here called lavender. It grows in the shade along rivers, lake shores. I'm gonna see if I can find some. Shit, brother. Horde strategy. Often the best strategy against a larger horde, especially for the unprepared, is to get good weapons and to stock up resources. Traverse the area and formulate an exit plan before attempting to take one down. My arms feeling. I'll try anything. Something I can smoke. Whatever. I'm gonna find some of this shit. I'm gonna make a burn sap out of it, and you're gonna shut the hell up about it. Yeah, okay. Sorry, brother. Just going stir crazy up here, you know. Ah, don't worry, booze man. We're riding north, I swear to God, not too much longer. You hear me? Yeah, out. Honestly, we can see the lavender on our radar, which is nice. Okay, this one's not lavender, but there's lavender over there. I hear a helicopter. Okay, we gotta return it to Boozer. I think they're observing the horde. I mean, there's a giant horde inside that train. If somebody's on my bike. I'm going to make frickin' lose it. All right. Can we fast travel back here? I think we probably can. There we go. See? Smart. Smart. I don't want to track no zombies while I'm on my bike. That'd be scary. We don't want to be scared. Only if this was live, then I'd want to be scared. All right, booze man. Let's go. Oh, what's this? We can get some gears. Yeah, there's some parts here. Oh, baseball bat. Always ready to go, which is nice. Again, they have a pretty cool camp. If they got some more people here, they can make something out of it for sure. Hey, Boozer. Uh, God damn it. Uh, it's a funny thing. I, I was remembering how uh, a few summers back, Sarah took me out to Bear Creek. We were picking lavender and uh, she Please. taught... <laughs> She taught me how to make this sap for burns and, uh... Look, I got out today. Okay? I actually had a look around the mound. I cleared some traps. The arm's almost as good as new. All right. Okay. I'm just gonna leave it right here. Hey, hey. Just give me a couple days. Okay? Just 
We'll ride up north like you said and get out of this shithole. Sure. Yeah. Take the lavender thing, man. I prepared it for you. I'm scared for Boozer. I'm, wor I'm worried for you, Booze Man. <laughs> I need you to be okay for me, okay? <laughs> I need you to be strong. But I think that's uh, a good spot to wrap up this this part of the walkthrough. We played a decent amount, did a couple of missions, got a 22 repeater, all that good stuff. Definitely going to be playing a lot more of this game. And if you want to see me play more, do be sure to hit that like button. Subscribe if you're new. And again, if you want to cop some fire merch, head on over to typical.store. Link in the description below. Uh, I'm going to be uploading this sometime of when I'm gone. So I'm gone from the 30th uh, up until the, the Friday. Which is, wait, let me let me pull out a calendar here. I'm gone from, I won't be live streaming, probably. I might live stream once while I'm there. We'll see if I can arrange that. But from the 30th to the 3rd, I probably won't be live streaming. I'll do my best to have videos for each of those days. But uh, it might be, you know, day on, day off here. So live stream will start again Saturday and Sunday. I uh, really do hope you enjoyed this. And uh, I, I hope it's going to be a lot of fun in New York. Samara, you excited? She said, yeah, yeet. Anyway, that's going to be it for this one, guys. I will see you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching. Hope you have an awesome day and peace out.